Hey guys. guys! It's Hudgeboo and Foo 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 Foo. And tonight we're going to be making egg carton maracas! Woo! <laughs> what you will need is stuff to decorate with. Woo! Oh, Empty egg carton. Bam! Dried pasta, rice, beans. Something really anything to fill, to fill it. Hold on. Scissors to chop stuff. Popsicle sticks. Hot glue gun, which we are not grabbing out right now. And some more glue sticks for your hot glue gun. And just a reminder, if you have a hot glue gun that leaks, well really in general, because sometimes they might leak. Just put like newspaper or some yeah, sort of and paper. I'll, and I'll have parental guidance when you're using Parental a, super, bleh, supervision? Yeah, but whatever it's called. When you're using hot glue gun, or just make sure that you're allowed to. And don't burn yourself. I have so, two burns that are ugly. Let's get started. Woo! So just to say, we will be sometimes changing our angles when we're hot gluing because... Can't bring the hot glue gun over here. Yeah. Let me just move this over. There we go. Okay. That's better. So, so first what you're going to do is so you're going to open your egg carton. And you're going to chop off the lid. So you're going to cut right here. And then also this little weird hanging thing. part. I will cut off. And you will cut off the little flat part. Um, we would rather you use sharp scissors. But be careful when you are using them don't have like really wimpy safety scissors. So once you've <laughs> cut your th things, you will just have this bit right here. And you're gonna cut out these little parts that are up. Because we realized if we used these, like the little parts where the eggs go in, we would have to figure out how to close them and we don't really feel like doing that. So we're just gonna cut out all the things. So you're gonna cut out I don't know. You're just gonna cut them out somehow. Okay, so we're gonna see two different ways. I'm gonna try the actual egg things, and she's gonna try the little triangle pokey things. So, so we're gonna cut them out. Yeah, but she'll tell you how to cut them out once I am all finished with just, you're only gonna need, you're gonna need four for two. Yeah, for these, you're gonna need four for two because then it's like the little area where the thing is gonna be. So I'm gonna cut mine out and she's gonna tell you what to do because she has scissors as well. Okay, so um, what I'm just doing is, again, you'll need four so then you can glue them together. And um, yeah, I suggest cutting them with really, really sharp scissors again because this is like a weird cardboard foam stuff. But yeah, I'm just cutting like up to where there's the little stopper and then I'm just cutting it off fully. Like there's a little line that's coming up and um, that line is a good cutter, like a way to show you where to cut. So yeah, and um, yeah, you just gotta cut around. It's very hard, so you should have someone watching you. We have two people staring at us. Not really staring at and us. And we have the internet staring at us. Whoa. So here's my little cup. Oh, I like that idea. And then I'm just gonna get these. Oh, I like that out. idea. Okay, so, so we're now gonna make trying a different method that's probably gonna chop my fingers off, which I'm not gonna try. So just follow that same method. If you think of an easier method, use it. Yeah, use it, and if it works, write it in the comments, because if we make these again, I don't want to struggle. Yeah, so we're gonna cut them out, but we're gonna make two like that, because I really like the shape of that, the first one. I don't know. Actually, comment down below which one you think looks cooler, the cap thing or these. Ooh, I uh, know that won't work. Never mind. So we're just gonna cut them out and be right back. So um, wait. Here's two together. 
you gotta make sure they're straight, but then it's gonna be like this little really, really tiny maraca, but it's gonna be super, super cute. So yeah, we're gonna cut these all out for our pears, and we will be right back for the next part. So, so now take your, your popsicle, popsicle sticks, sticks, and for her, you're just sticking it in the bottom, and for yeah. me, you have to cut off the round part of it. So for me, and then you have to glue it <laughs> onto the bottom. All the way across the kitchen. And then you have to glue it onto the bottom. Yeah, so it's like this. that's for her. And then for me, you see how there's a flat bit right here. You're gonna take your popsicle stick, and see these ones have the holes, and you're just gonna pop it in. So then it's like this, and you're gonna take your hot glue gun and put hot glue all around right here, and all around inside. Okay. So I would rather you do this method, so then you don't have to do any gluing on the inside. Okay, so now this is for my method. Once you're finished with this, you're going to fill it up with, I'm doing about like, here's five. Um, hey, wait, don't fill yet. Don't here's fill yet. Five Hold on, she's I'm not. I'm putting in um, about like 10 little pastas. So, yeah. So, one, two, three, four, five. If your um, filling is edible, you are allowed to eat it. Don't feel like you don't have to get to eat it. Yeah, because we've been eating this pasta a lot. <sighs> Tell me. So for me, as my hot glue is drying, my one is probably all dry, sorry, my leg is stuck. I'm gonna take, um, I'm gonna put about three, just to, three, I'm gonna put in four just to start out. And then I'm just gonna take the two that aren't glued together, shake them. If you don't like the sound of it, you can either add more, add less. So I just added two more because I thought maybe I could make it a little. Yes, so six is a good amount for mine. So you're just gonna make you're gonna kind of dump them out and make little piles. I'm gonna go hot glue. So my hot glue is all dry. You're not gonna put hot glue on the inside. I just thought that was kind of a waste because then your things might get stuck. So you're just gonna put in, for me, you're just gonna put in, this is to try it with the amount of noodles that you have. You're just gonna put it in, put one on top. I like that. So now you're just gonna glue your things together in whatever way fits for your maraca. Okay, so for hot gluing, I hot glued this one. And so you're just gonna you just put a little bit of hot glue around the edge. And then you are just gonna wait a real, um, you're gonna put the top one on, then you're gonna wait a while before you, um, start to shake it because if it's not like I would say wait like three minutes or five minutes or something so then you make sure that the hot glue is really dry so then none of your inside filling stuff gets stuck to the walls and then it won't make any noise and I just added you know how I had six before I went from four to six now I have about ten in here ten is a good amount ten is a good amount so yeah we're gonna finish hot gluing and for me all you're gonna do is hot glue Make sure all your sides are level. You're gonna hot glue the sides, like these bits, and you're just gonna stick the other one on, stick the other top on, and then you can trim it up how you need. And if these little corner bits don't have glue or something to protect it, just grab like another piece of this or something to cover it. Okay, yeah. so also um, a way to like, if it's not even yeah, and it's really this. hard to get even, then a, something to do is to just put a bit of a, a line of hot glue around like where the edge is so then it doesn't, no, nothing comes out because that's just really bad. So got to wait a while but when, um, a smart thing to do if you're doing my method is when it's drying so then you don't have to wait a, even longer is when it's drying to stick on your little popsicle sticks. Mine, I cut off the round bit and then I marked on the other one with a pencil where to cut it so then they are the same length. 
So I just glued on one of mine. I'm adding glue to the edges. I'm sorry, were you going to talk? Yeah. Sorry, I'm just adding glue to the edges on the outside, just in case they didn't go on perfectly. They'll... So these aren't really even my way, but they're a cool, unique shape. So if they aren't even, I would say get them even if you're like me, and just put them next to each other and trim off the excess. So this is, even if your glue gun is hot, that means the glue is even hotter and it'll dry quicker. Be as like, be really careful and make sure that it's fully uh -oh. dry. Mine doesn't really have a lot because they got stuck to the glue. Yeah. So she might be restarting. Mm, yeah, probably. So I'm going to restart. And then we're going to come back to you when everything is finished. Sorry Ooh. about this very long video. And our videos, we did have a little editing streak thing where we did edit our videos. But, but it was hard to make them. It was hard to make them because we had to watch our time because it would only be up to five minutes. So um, sorry if you really liked the editing but sorry she edited like too video. much. Yeah, the one I did a lot of editing, yeah, it and it didn't look much. good at all. Yeah. But we're noobs, so we're yeah. pretty new to YouTube, so sorry about that. Well, new to um, making YouTube videos, but not to watching YouTube. I'm a pro at that. Yeah, we're pretty much pros. Yeah. 24-7 YouTube. Yeah. Bye-bye. So my other one failed, so I'm just going to have one. And as you can see, I added a bit of egg carton to cover it. And now, you can go on to decorating once all your... I already pop. decorated my sticks. Which is this? That's mine, but it failed. So, now you're just going to get on to decorating the sticks and the actual maraca. You know, this this thing does... We're so we finished. finished! So, this one... So, those are hers. And I draw them in this one. I just went random with the hot glue and it looks really cool. This one's a little donut and it's got some tan right here. So it looks a lot like a donut. So mine, this one is all nude. And actually my like six to 10 noodles that are in here, most of them got stuck except for the one. But, and then this one, I showed you guys when it wasn't nude. It just says Hajibu on the handle. It says hi, hi on the side, and then a bunch of different, like, weird emoji faces. And then I made a little tiny one just for fun. It's very quiet. I don't know what makes it so that you hear it better. So, hold on one second. So, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoy, and comment, 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 comment. Like, 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 subscribe, subscribe, and watch us all the time. Bye! And... Today might actually be a double video day. Hold on, we will. Never mind, it's not gonna be a double video day. No. Comment, 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 like, 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 subscribe, subscribe, and watch us all the time. Bye! For real this time.